Okay, so my tag came today from Torch, Torch Lit Studios, and it cost sixty-five dollars for an NFC tag. This is what it actually looks like. Thumb for scales. It's not the smallest thing, and I'm going to implant it in my hand using this one which comes preloaded in this applicator, which is what they use when they microchip a cat at the vets. So, no big deal, in theory. Precautions, I'm gonna thoroughly sterilize the area. I put some EMLA cream on about an hour ago. So that should be numbing up nicely. And I've just had a couple of ibuprofen um, which I'm going to let work and then hopefully that should make the pain not too bad, but I can't imagine it'll be that bad. So, film, my hand, okay. So, you see I've been drawing on it already, but you need to find the line where it's going to sit. And basically, that's the edge of the bone there, you don't want to go that far. This is the index finger along here, don't want to go that far. I want it sitting in this fleshy bit here, the end of it there, so that if it gets hit, it's protected by the tag, by the flesh rather. And the way the tag works is you stick it in, go to like here, and then pull back and retract it so the edge of it is here to here. And that looks like it'll be okay. Okay, we filming? Can you see my hand? Get a bit closer. Yes, I'm hand. filming. Yeah, okay, it's cool. It. Yes, all. All right. What do you think about me doing this? It's horrible. It's stupid. It's horrible. Okay, good. Don't do it. All right. So I'm going to open the tag. We. Yeah, and first things is safety catch off. So, hopefully the lidocaine in the EMLA cream will be working now. And where I want to do this is put it in there, go through, stop there, pull back a bit, and to deposit the chip exactly where that black line is. So. I'm going to finally use one of these for sterilisation. Okay. It's going to be fine. We've done worse. Yeah. Much worse. Sugar. Okay. So, are you ready? No. Open one of those for me, will you? Put the chip in the syringe. The chip's in the syringe. <laughs> no, no, that com comes with the chip already in the syringe. Okay, so pull back a teeny weeny bit. Press as I pull it out. Well, hey, I'm implanted. Have you got one of those wound wipes for me? That's it. So is that going to be shown there forever? No, that's a black mark. I just did oh. it in the right place. So hey, I'm gonna just put a bit of pressure on that. I'm doing the wrong using the wrong thing, so it's using dry. <laughs> You're right. I should be using some dry, but there's hardly any blood. There's a tiny mark. And <laughs> it appears to be in the right place. Okay, well, I'm three days past injecting my hand, and you can see the tiny, tiny scar and the chip under my hand, if I flex, you can just see that popping up. I'm one-handed, so this isn't great. But if you look to the left of the sky, you can just see a white line. I'm very happy with the placement. It didn't hurt that much. Everything's fine, no infection. And I've programmed it to go to my homepage, uh, which has got a link to my V-card on it. And it also opens my Moto X running lollipop. 
um, when I swipe instead of a password. So, all done, all good. Um, don't try this at home. This you should probably go to a piercer. But actually, if you live miles from anyone who is likely to understand what you're trying to do, like I do, then it's really not too bad. All right. Cheers. Bye.